is make-believe, and there is making believers. So far this season, it has been the latter for the Toronto Raptors. A team that can play big. A team that can play small. But the question is, can this first place team keep doing what it's doing? The Raptors say yes. But today, the litmus test against the most feared team in the NBA, riding twin towers to not only respectability, but all the way to the top of the world. They are the San Antonio Spurs. Today, two first place teams meet head on. The NBA champions are in Toronto, and we have it next on CTV. Just off the lake shore in metropolitan Toronto, it's a dreary December Sunday afternoon, but come on side because inside, it's going to be exciting. Expecting the biggest crowd of the year here for the Toronto Raptors and the defending NBA champions who hoisted the trophy only a few short months ago. A team that features an admiral and also his first mate, who may be one of the best players, if not the best player in the game. Tim Duncan arriving in the building, and moments ago, the Raptors with their customary pregame ritual. in the Midwest and the leaders in the Central. Well, certainly the Raptors have to be thrilled that they do have Antonio Davis at its strength up front to battle San Antonio. And there's that good sign we talked about off the top, that mid-range jump shot. Vince Carter really adding to his game with these rounds. He takes care of the ball. Nice pass there. That's a little too easy. You don't see that kind of a hoop. Raptors now down by two, 8-6 with seven and a half to go first quarter. Vince. And Chucky Brown in the air, flailing at nothing, and then steps inside the three-point line and ties the game. Take that shot. It's become very, very difficult to defend with that kind of quickness. A block for Carter. Nobody's picking up the basketball. He's looking to make something happen when he comes in. Great pass. Vince Carter on the feed from Doug Christie. Vince now has eight points. He guided in. 35-34. Toronto, 4-14 to go before Hi, halftime. Raptors sticking right with the champs. Vince got it again. Vince Carter now 12 points. And you can see how Mario only backed off Vince when he turned and faced him. Two to go before the half. Fall away again from Vince. That is becoming his biggest weapon. You can talk all you want about the high-flying dunks. Gets it. Carter dribbles out of it to the basket. Carter, there's one for the highlight reel. And a difficult move right at David Robinson. But here's the double team, but watch this move right at David Robinson. And that sweet touch off the board. The San Antonio Spurs have never lost two games in a row since February 28th because of Vince and the players surrounding him. Exactly. Vince Carter really adding a different look for Toronto Raptors. And there's that jump shot again. Robinson blocked by Ninth block by the Raptors, Vince Carter! Oh, you've got to be kidding! And the crowd's on their feet with that one. Excellent help defense, Antonio Davis, not only making a block rod, but keeping it in play to allow Vince Carter to get the crowd off their feet. Well, he just went to the penthouse on the tower. Well, everybody's been waiting for something to happen. Look at this help. Now, look where that ball deflected right to Vince Carter, and he knows one thing. Go to the basket. No defense is there. Chucky Brown hesitates, and there's the dunk. But you got to love that help. Charles Oakley did a great job of staying down, steering Robinson into the block. And you have to love that finish. But look at this elevation by The elevator Davis. man right here. Vince Carter from the side even, able to dunk that ball. In the first half, it was Avery Johnson and Mario Welly. Now it's Chucky Brown. Vince Carter <laughs> elevates with the hook shot. That drops now 24 for Vince Carter. Both teams a little more relaxed, letting loose. And Vince Carter with a sweet touch up high. Which Carter not want? A few more threes being knocked down. Take away the three. Vince again! Time crossover, and he absolutely surprised David Robinson. Unbelievable elevation on that play. Well, Vince was off his feet, and so is this crowd. Biggest of the season. 
The Human Highlight Reel Part 2 does it again. Wow. That's nasty. <laughs> it's unbelievable. Tracy McGrady off to his cousin, Vince Carter. Three-pointer, got it! The new uniform works. Who will pull it out now? McGrady, off to Vince. Eight seconds on the shot clock. Long shot again! The dish from Tracy, the swish from Vince. Supreme confidence. He really believes he can make that shot at any time. Vince Carter again. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Well, we saw him take over in the third, and now this is his time, the fourth quarter. Again, Vince Carter. A career high, 35. Talk about some acrobatics. That was Jordan-esque. When Vince Carter makes up his mind to go to the hoop, he will not be denied. Previous possession hits a jump shot. This time getting the ball and seeing he's got an opening, going up hard underneath Tim Duncan, and then getting it to the glass before help arrives from David Robinson. Tremendous effort by Vince Carter. One more look. Look at that hang time. Is it any coincidence that he steps up also, had a career-high 34 against the Lakers and Shaquille O'Neal, and 35 against Duncan and Robinson, the powerful teams. Vince Carter understands if you want to be considered among the best in this league, you have to do it against the best in this league. And he's not afraid to perform and step up big. And you can see the numbers, both players having tremendous basketball games. Back to Carter. He's taken a couple of long-range jumpers. That one's a runner. And he did it again! Now you know when you're knocking in shots like that at this point, that's the kind of impact he's had. So now very important for the Raptors to continue to make their free throws. Vince perfect from the line today. Two-point game now. 15.3 yeah. seconds yeah. remaining. Yeah. Will yeah. that one get the bounce? It does. And the second one is tougher if you miss the first. The first place Toronto Raptors have beaten the NBA champions. They have now beaten all of the elite teams in the NBA this season. Yes, they are for real. Vince Carter, career high 39. We know you as Mr. Fourth Quarter. You got it going in the third quarter in this day. Hey, I just needed to step up for my team, offensively and defensively. Um, I've been shooting about 30 percent, and um, I, I felt I wasn't really taking good shots. I mean, I was taking good shots, but off balance shots, things like that. Tonight, I just wanted to concentrate and just do what my team wanted me to do. How big of this is another benchmark win, beating the world champions? It's big. I mean, it's just showing the heart of this team that we were stepping up and we're trying to we're trying to let everybody know that we're for real this year and we're capable and we're, we have a goal. We're trying to reach it and, and this is our this is what we need to match up against. D Brown shot the other night. This victory today. Do you think you have an official sixth man now in the Air Canada Center? Oh man, yeah. We hope so. We need to continue to win and it can happen. It can happen if, if we can get everybody to believe what we believe in. Good things can happen for the Raptors. Keep it going, Vince. Thank you. So Vince Carter, 39 points, a career high. Listen to this place. <laughs> and it's been a long incoming, Rod. The Toronto Raptors have played some pretty good basketball against some pretty good teams, and the crowd almost not aware of how good this team has the potential to be. Finally, the crowd come in life, as Vince said, maybe becoming that sixth man they need.